So I've been reading um, this morning, as I do every morning, which is good, but I wanted to share this with you. I was reading Hebrews chapter 12, uh, verses 1 and 2, but really I focused on verse 2 is where the Spirit of the Lord directed me. And look, it says here, looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross, despising the shame, and sat down at the right hand of the of the throne of God. So God said, hey, glory, hallelujah. He said, focus on the joy. Huh? He said, focus on the joy. Focus on what's coming because we got to stay focused. This will help us endure. Focusing on where we're going will help us endure where we are. If I focus all my attention on what's going on right now, what I'm going through, um, I'm afraid about the future, I'm afraid of things to come. No, no, I'm not afraid because I know who holds everything. God, Jesus did not focus on the cross. He knew the cross was coming. He pressed through. He focused on the joy that was set before him. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. This is our example. Focus on the joy that is set before us. Heaven is set before us. Eternity is set before us. Streets paved with gold is set before us. Being in the presence of the Lord forever is set before us. Focus on the joy that is set before us. Then we can endure our crosses. We won't have to worry about being ashamed because we're putting our faith in the Lord. So Lord, would you help us today? Help us to focus on what matters. Eternity. You matter. Your presence. Your joy. Because in your presence is the fullness of joy. At your right hand. Hallelujah. Oh, there are pleasures forevermore. Help us to focus on those things. And lay aside every weight. And the sin that does so easily beset us. So that we could run this race with patience. And endure unto the end. In Jesus name.